What's good, Apple Squad? Squad? It's your boy Ty. And your girl Mar. And we are back with another video. So it's windy out here. It's, and yes. It's about to rain for the first time in 27 years. So Facts. not actually 27 years for those who think it's been 27 years. But um Marlena just said before the camera came on. Those who haven't, we did another Would You Rather some time back when our channel was still dork. Um and it was like the same kind of the, weather. Yeah, it was like same weather. It was about to rain and stuff. We tried to hurry up and finish it. Um, but yeah, so that's an interesting fact. What if it was one year ago today? That, that'd, that'd be, be funny. <laughs> it's not one year ago today. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it's July 23rd. Yeah, we'll we can check later. Anyways, um, so yeah, we're here with another Would You Rather. Um, and Damn, everybody loud today. It's, it's, I don't know, it's probably Thursday. It's usually quiet around here. Everybody loud. The wind loud. The birds. The birds, like. Our establishment is usually quieter, 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 quieter. Well, let's just get into it. Y'all know how we do rather work. Everybody played it on camera, off camera, at parties, at home, with family, with friends. Everybody play Would You Rather. If you have never played Would You Rather, then you are the biggest introvert of them all. Um, anyways, all right, first one. Would you rather lose the ability to read or lose the ability to speak? Read. Dang. Like, give it some time. All right. Um, <clears throat> well, I guess I should see you do. I will say speak um, for the simple fact that I know how to communicate with sign language. Um, I, I'll have to learn a lot because I forgot. But I used to go to a sign language school growing up. The mostly the most I remember is like my ABCs and like I remember the letters. I know all the letters. I remember numbers up to like fifteen, I think. Maybe up to like nineteen, somewhere around there. Um, and like I remember certain things like this is uh, water. This is a uh, stop talking. What else we got? I think this is a love, and this is sorry. Um, this is thank you. This is fuck you. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, this is the B word, I believe. Um, what else? This is, I think this is death, I believe. Uh, I go on those. Like A, B, C, D. Point is, I could go all day about sign language. We had to switch phones because Marlene phone garbage. But, um, yeah, so I would easily say the ability to speak just because... One, I already know a little bit of sign language. I can just learn sign language. Um, plus, I need to read. Like, I like to read. Like, I can't read about J. Cole new song if if I can't, I don't know what to say. I will pick. You clearly who, said read. Yeah, because who that who that famous person that can't read? Floyd Mayweather. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh, this is Floyd gosh. Mayweather reading the 10 second drops I just did. I'm Floyd Mayweather, and I, I've, I'm Floyd Mayweather, and I've joined Heart Radio for the show. Your stripes, you, okay. I'm Floyd. <laughs> oh my gosh! Is he, he struggles with reading, but yes, it, or it seems like it. We don't. <laughs> he See, definitely struggles. Yeah, <laughs> it's definitely a struggle. Yeah, there. but anyway. So he does just fine. Oh my gosh. I guess, but he has money if people to pay around him. You do not. Okay, I can. He has hundreds of millions of dollars. So you ain't gonna teach me? You ain't gonna be there for me while I'm teaching? I'm not gonna be there 24 seven. Okay, but you can be like, we got this. But like, you he can't have, speak, I can't the read. The point of the would you write, like you wouldn't be able to read no more ever. Okay, you wanna read for me? <laughs> All right, would you rather always be 10 minutes late or always be 20 minutes early? I'm going to say 10 minutes late. <laughs> I'm always late. I'm late everywhere I go. I'm always late. That's like, I'm fashionably late. 10 minutes, that's a fashionably late time. I can show up 20 minutes early. But like, what's the fun in that? You the first one there. Versus 10 minutes late. Everybody looking at me like, you always late. And I'm just like, you know what I mean? No? Okay. Well, that's what I say. So, 10 minutes late. <clears throat> is that saying like, to everything, for example, a funeral. I would say 20 minutes early. 
Of course. I I'm always, I get up early. I do everything early. And Monty so. watching this, she'd say 10 hours early. Mm -hmm. Monty is the earliest bird I have ever met a mother. <laughs> Anyways, next question. Would you rather have one real get out of jail free card or a key that open any door? What'd you say? One real get out of jail free card. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> because I can go rob a bank and use my get out of jail free card. But the bank or heist got to be successful. What's the what's the point of the heist if you're not gonna get away with it, and then you're gonna go to jail and then you're gonna get out of jail free card? But it was kind of pointless because you didn't get anything to begin with. If it's successful and I bury the money somewhere and then I, they later on find me, and I, I use my get out of jail free card. Well, that's if it's successful, which is a big if, especially in today's age because how many bank robbers get off? This ain't no movie. Well, I have a bunch of credit cards. Um, I say a uh, key to open any door because I can open any door. They mean I open the vault door and I can easily take it with no problem. But, but, no, 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 mm, hear me out, hear me out, hear right. me out because this is my case. If I was to hypothetically go in there, I don't know, just everything completely covered at when it's past the time that anything is open, I have the key to every door so I can get in there in every single door, no matter what the door is. It says, any, it, said, it says, or a key that opens any door. So therefore, literally, for example, all of these buildings, but does I can it work open multiple door. doors, or just any one door? I'm assuming, what is based off what it say, a key that opens any door. Look right here, one free crime of your choice, of, uh, or a life oh. of limited theft and blah blah blah. See? Okay. Nah, you know, okay, you said what you said. I'm having an I still stand by my answer. Whatever. I, I'm easily using the key because I, I can go anywhere. Right off. Like, I can literally open literally any door in the world. Anything that's ever been locked. Okay. Easy. Would you rather know the history of every object you touch or be able to talk to animals? That's kind of difficult. I would probably say the history of every object I touch mm. because there's like a penny probably has seen more than what any of us in this whole world has ever seen. That's true. You know what? I will also say that because like I always tell Marlena, like I, I want to know like a lot of like the history behind like all the like unsolved mysteries and crimes and stuff. So if I went to the place that happened and I touched something that was there, mm -hmm. I could know what happened. Yeah. Boom. So I would say the same thing. It'd be cool to talk to animals though, especially like, like a pet that you own. Cause then, for example, Gigi, who is acting dang fool in the house, <laughs> you can tell him like, hey, chill out. She like, nah, you chill out. And then we can, all right, all right, cool. Next, would you rather be married to a 10 with a bad personality or a six with an amazing personality? Six. Um, yeah, six with an amazing Where's personality. What? Ooh, I feel you good. I feel you good. But look, because it's more to life than just looks, y'all. That's all mm. a problem. See, if you younger, y'all y'all probably be better team, man. Like, yeah, cause y'all only care about physical appearance. That's all. Bad personality would most likely be a toxic relationship. Exactly. Personality is everything. My nail. <laughs> your history. You only went for teens, my boy. You only went for teens. Anyways, um, but yeah, so it's, it's, I feel like you, you should always look for a person for what's an inside, even though that sounds corny and cliche. It's true. That's how you find your soulmate. And then on top of that, in my, like in my opinion, even if a person physically looks like a six to you and their personality is a 10, the more you know them and when you, you know, fall the finer they're going to get. Exactly. So like when you're with them, it's like, okay, they went from a six to a 10 because of their personality if that makes sense y'all learn one day y'all mm -hmm. we'll we put y'all on game you know what i'm saying y'all kids y'all i do y'all would you rather have all traffic lights you approach be green or never had to stay in the line again look at that gecko i think they pronounce gecko you watch too many commercials i do uh <laughs> never have to stand in the line again never have to stand in line again because we <clears throat> To be honest, we mostly take the highway everywhere, so we really don't have green lights. So now, even if that's the case, I always use the red light to handle shit in the car. Yeah. So I be chilling at red lights. So I'm not really in a rush. <clears throat> something really going on. I would say never have to stand the line again. 
Because sometimes I'll you be in a rush and need to go somewhere, but the line be mad long. And then think about it for stuff like Black Friday mm, or yep. uh, any holiday, basically. Anything, any promotions or whatever is going on. If the new Jordans came out and it's 50 mm. people, I mean 50,000 people in the line, you ain't got to wait. So easily, I feel like the line is better. Better mm -hmm. choice. Would you rather give up all drinks except for water or give up eating anything that was cooked in an oven? Easily give up all things except no, all uh, water, all drinks except water. That's what we mainly we drink, drink water anyway. Water to begin with. So um, we stopped drinking soda, what, two years ago? Mm -hmm. Feel like longer actually, but I know it's been probably like realistically like two years. And I, I, I'm not a fan of microwave food at all. As I got older, it got worse and worse. Like so when I was like 15, 16, it was cool, especially because like I was working and then, you know, I didn't want what my mom cooked or like I got home too late so food's cold. I don't like leftovers so I like make a I'd rather make a, a TV dinner or something like that. I think that's 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 an easy one. Would you rather be able to see ten minutes into your own future or ten minutes into the future of anyone but yourself? Okay, so if you if I'm able to alter it then I would pick my own future. But if I'm not able to alter it, I would pick someone else's because if I'm able to alter my own, then it's like, okay, this mistake might cause me to die, so let me not go ahead and do that. But if I can't, then I don't wanna, I, I low-key don't wanna know I'm finna die. I think I'll say the same. I, I, think, I think I agree. Would you rather have an easy job working for someone else or work for yourself, but work incredibly hard? Um, easily work for yourself mm -hmm. um, because of course, a lot of people in life, you know, want their own things, own businesses, whatever it is. Something that you're not clocking in for somebody. You don't, mm -hmm. you don't gotta worry about. You ain't really making no real money working for somebody else. That's true. Like, but, um, like realistically, a lot of people, when they got easier jobs, you know, but you're working for somebody else, they'll be comfortable with that throughout the rest of their life. So, um, but in the words of Kevin Hart, everybody that we wanna be famous, nobody wanna put the work in. So, you know. You gotta put in that work. I agree. Would you rather be able to control animals, but not humans, with your mind, or control electronics with your mind? My thing is always dependent. Money. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> if I could control the electronics, that means I could stop the vault from opening. I could, like, girl. If I control electronics, I can just a money machine or get out a whole bunch of money at the ATM. That's true. But if I can control humans, I can just have them bring me the money. But you can't control humans. Animals. Oh, animals. Yeah. Oh, then electronics. I'll say human. I mean, I'll say animals because I'm, I'm, I'm going to contest what she said. Because allegedly, hypothetically, if you can control animals, you can just use them to get the money and bring it to you. Hey, it, 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 Like, for example, if it was a rhino, ain't nobody finna stop a rhino. Of course, they could call, like, whoever. I ain't trying to get the animals, you know what I'm saying? But if all goes well, that's my name, bitch. You know what I'm but saying? But if all doesn't. I mean, all wouldn't go well if you had an ATM and you take money from the register or the ATM. They got cameras. Like if you if money, for example, if anybody seen money spit out the ATM when you're taking that money, even though like you didn't physically break the ATM or anything, it's still government money. <clears throat> so what you you can't because you can't control the money you control the machine so the I can control machine, how much money the machine gives me but it will still spit the money out i mean i'm not finna take a, the whole everything out the atm at but once but even if you took twenty dollars you sick. stole twenty dollars from the atm so they have you on camera doing that i mean that still probably be said consider a petty crime i don't know i don't follow the law but i'm gonna figure it out we gonna <laughs> Girl, I just use a whole bunch of like oh it'd be plenty of coyotes over here i just take all the coyotes have them ransack um some place with money and take it like that. Allegedly, uh, allegedly. If would you rather have unlimited international first class tickets or never have to pay for food at restaurants? I think I'll go for the international tickets. I would too. Because how much money did I say? That's it. Yeah, I save a lot of money. And you can just take the money and buy the food at the restaurant. For example, like the first class ticket cost. 
six, seven hundred or something like that. I'm just throwing the price out. Um, that's for one one international trip. Versus, if you're eating at a restaurant, it's like an all you eat buffet because you get whatever you want. But at the end of the day, on average, people would spend like forty dollars at a restaurant. So it's like depending on the restaurant. Yeah, depending on the restaurant. So like you know, all together throughout the all the times you eat at a restaurant, that'll add up to six, seven hundred throughout that whole year or something like that. You know, all together, not at once. Unless, you know, y'all y'all be pigging out or something, but <laughs> that, that's what I say. Would you rather be forced to dance every time you heard music or be forced to sing along to any song you heard? Probably sing. Sing? Uh, actually, yeah. Especially because, like, if you work and, like, you know, most places play music in the store. So, like, you'd be sitting there dancing all day to the song. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'll say sing. I was kind of thinking, but yeah, I'll, I'll say sing as well. Definitely the same. Would you rather have all your clothes fit perfectly or have the most comfortable pillow, blankets, and sheet in existence? Definitely the clothes. Really? Oh, I thought you were gonna do the sheets. Cause you, like, what I was thinking was, cause like how you always talk about the bed and stuff, like especially when you get off work and stuff, every time you lay in the bed, you're like, oh, like, so I thought it makes sense that you have the most comfortable stuff in existence that you sleep on every day. Like not, not in the not in the day, not in the like not in your area. In existence, you literally got the best comfort and stuff in existence. That's why I was thinking. But go ahead. See, it's like I kind of want to pick. I was gonna literally, I was gonna pick the comfort, but it's like if I'm all her clothes she can't perfectly. Fit, bro. I don't have to worry about it. Cause you her know. whole closet is a problem. But I still thought you would take your your rest over like clothes. That's mm -hmm. why I said that. But I would take the, I would take the sheets and stuff. Um, one, I'm skinny, so I don't have to worry about too much clothing, uh, except for like stuff like this, where like I do that and it goes up. But um, for the most part, it, it's basically solid. So sleeping, oh my gosh, especially like once I'm. Y'all should have seen this man yesterday. I, I was asleep. Like, I, I was gone. Would you rather be an unimportant character in the last movie you saw or an unimportant character in the last book you read? If we go on right now, what was the last movie you saw? Illegal Tender. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> In the last book, we read a few sentences of Three Far. <laughs> I say illegal tender. I'll be an illegal tender. I'll be an unimportant. Well, but like, what's the unimportant character? I mean, I'm being slumped, like, like them little bodyguards and shit. Like, I'm like, I'm like, yes, I'm like, what kind of unimportant? Like, unimportant, like, I went, I was at the school with dude, like. Yeah, the movie, definitely. You'll be in the background. It said, no, 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 man. That's my favorite movie, y'all. Illegal tender, watch it. It's, 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 it's cool. It's a solid seven. I feel like the mom should have been the main character, though. Would you rather move to a new city or town every week or never be able to leave the city or town you were born in? Move to I'm a different moving city to a different town city. every week. <laughs> every week. For one, for one, if y'all don't know, we've been moving a lot the last few years. We move all the damn time. So it's normal. Like, mm -hmm. like we were thinking about moving this year, later this year, but we, we, we came to a decision. But anyways, um, I couldn't be in my birthplace for my whole life, bro. It's it's, it's no, rough. Sir. No sir, no sir. The no. people that live still there don't even want to be there their whole life. Exactly. So that's that's an easy. I move. I move every day, twenty four seven. I'll be on the road. I have RV. It don't, it don't matter. Would you rather live in virtual reality, where you are all powerful, or live in the real world and be able to go anywhere, but not be able to interact with anyone or anything? I will most likely pick. The virtual reality. Because I, I can't, as introverted as I am, I can't not interact with people. Yeah. I can't not do that. Plus, you're the man there, so. Mm -hmm. Everything revolves around you. When <laughs> you put it like that, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't, I could, especially me, I talk too much. I can't, I can't not like, but if I can't talk to nobody at all, that's, that drives your mental crazy. That does. Would you rather be infamous in history books or be forgotten after a death? 
infamous in history but everybody gonna forever know you whether it's some good or bad they gonna know who you is but if you forget about me then it's like what did i really mean yeah i i, I can't be forgotten about like that's one thing i always want people to like i want people to always speak me speak about me and to a point where people are like damn i know he did but bro you always talking about it. i want it to be like that like for example, if I was to perish and my friends like they're doing something, they they like, oh, new J Cole song drop, bro. Todd would love this song. Oh, Todd is Todd that. Like I I want that kind of stuff. Like, um, so history easily. You know what I'm saying? Be a part of something rather it's good, bad, ugly, whatever. You a part of it. So, um, rather than be somebody who just nobody think about. Can't do it. Sorry. Anyways, that's gonna wrap it up today. Um. We'll talk to y'all later. We finna go record another video. Um, and then, I don't know. The sun kind of coming out. It was just cloudy a minute ago, but who knows? And that man is really hard at work right now. So we <laughs> about to get up out of here. As of always. We love you all. We'll see y'all in the next video. Forever and always. Always and forever. Uh, uh, I'll squat. Logging off.